Hey guys, Gene Daigle here. Um, this was a flight from April Fool's Day. I hadn't flown since February 23rd, just due to weather and uh, just getting a hip replaced and other things going on in my life. I'm just flying around, looking at the buds on the trees. We're gonna get leaves real soon. Just thought I'd share. I am on the newest firmware, 1.08. I didn't mess with the white balance, the new white balance adjustments. I just left it on. Um, my EV was zero and I locked it. I want to show you guys something I found when I was flying around my neighborhood. Somebody has a big solar panel array you see right now in the middle of the screen down there. And that's for one house. That's a lot of solar panels. Town's been pretty boring in the coronavirus deal. Um, not a lot going on. You can't go out to eat. Can't go to any bars. Can't really do much of anything. In the middle of summer, I'd be all right with that because I'd be out flying all the time. Just showing the downtown. There's a few cars running around, but pretty much nobody parked down along the, the old buildings down there. Mavic Mini did great. I hear a bunch of people having trouble with the new firmware with the drone either just shutting off mid or flight or um, energy issues, power issues with the battery. I think we're going to find this with the lithium ion batteries that they're only good for about a hundred or a little over recharges from what I've read. So they're going to lose power a lot faster and once you get down below 60-50%, you don't have the amount of energy to the motors that you normally would. So your loft is decreased, your speed is decreased. So it's not necessarily about how powerful the Mini is. You're going to see at the beginning, 100% battery, that it has much more ability to fight the wind than it does toward the end of the battery or even under 50%. So just keep that in mind when you're flying this. And here I took off sport mode, full blast, just to see how it performed and it did really well. Pretty quick little bugger. I just don't think this is a power issue. I know I've said this before, but these lithium ion batteries are just totally different than the LiPo on the power that's provided to the motors at different percentages. The problem is we have too many new users, or not too many, but a lot of new year users that don't never messed with LiPo before and they don't understand why their Mini can't fight the wind when it was fine at 100%, but back down to 40% you just don't have it. I did notice with this new update that the strong wind warning doesn't last very long. It just pops up and goes away even though there wasn't a whole lot of wind this day. I plan on doing messing around with the, uh, the settings on the new white balance but we'll do that in a later video when I get some better weather. It's just windy here almost every day or raining. Well, if you guys enjoyed it, please like and subscribe, and I appreciate everyone watching. Have a good day. Thank you.